Howdy, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to part 8 of Mega Man X4. Not including the boss rush, what would make this part 9? And so now, we are taking on the final boss of the game, and you know who it is. Your Sigma! Why you? No, I will never let you do it. So how does Repla Force make this weapon in the first place? I might have missed it somewhere, but shouldn't the human be cautious if the Repla Force were building these things? I'm pretty sure it took a long time to build it too. But anyway, Sigma here is weak against fire, so you should take out the fire, rising fire, and attack him with it. What I usually like to do is that. I attack him with four normal shot, and then the fifth one I will charge it up. And after you attack him twice, he will uh, appear in the very left or right of the screen, and then try to slash you. You can just dash all the way to where to where he is and attack him. So look, I'm charging up my shot right now, and when he's appear, booyah! One hit. Anyway, the second form, he's weak again, lightning web, so I would use it. Now, the second form is kind of annoying if you are staying on the ground. Um, he gonna throw his weapon at you. The first one will always be where you are, whichever side you are. If you're on the left, you throw it on the left. If you're on the right, you throw it on the right. And then for the second one, though, if you are on the wall, he gonna throw it at the wall and you're gonna be stuck there, which will prevent you from wall climbing the wall <laughs> but and that would be a good thing not bad at all because if you're staying on the ground and that thing stuck on the ground those electricity gonna come out and it's really is annoying to dodge because you are scaling the wall and he decided to send out a whole bunch of boomerangs at you which is rather annoying to dodge because you're getting attacked from the air and the ground because of his uh, weapon but uh, if you're climbing the wall you'll be fine and you can actually stand behind Sigma and attack him that way which is pretty uh, funny and <laughs> when I was a kid I always got pissed off because they stopped me from getting that health, pal health pellet So this is a third form of Sigma, pretty uh, weird looking. You can actually destroy that thing if you charge up your rising fire, but I never do it because most of the time I just try to dodge it. Anyway, the Sigma head, he is weak, weak against the ground hunter, so I recommend you use it. And for that one, what I usually like to do is I would climb on one of the head and then hover and then try to dodge it that way and you can see it's not not very reliable but I managed to dodge his attack 90% eh, of times so hey that's good enough for me see just climb and then hover you would be fine and that is the worst attack to me, it's the stupidest and worst attack of Sigma. I never been able to hit him when he does that. Um, I have a feeling that if you charge up your ground hunter, it's gonna go through the blue head and then hit Sigma mouth that way, mouth that way. But uh, I haven't tried it yet. And for some reason, the Sigma body's body always do the DN attack on me which pretty annoying because you don't get to attack him that much and I recharge up like four shot ready for that body but then he DN and I met I couldn't use it so I have to use it on the Sigma head instead so yeah Another DN. Oh my god. Anyway, the blue one should be the easiest one to dodge. 
because all it does is, is spitting out liquid nitrogen in gas form I guess why liquid nitrogen? Well, because I work for my university chemistry building and <laughs> I pretty much play with liquid nitrogen every day. So that's all I can think of when I see that white gas. <laughs> but uh, for this one, I usually just like to charge up all four shots and then hover and attack sick my head that way. Face. And for this one, what I like to do is if I'm on the ground, it's gonna shoot fire at me and what I do, I'm gonna scale those two heads that's sitting next to me and dodge it. And when you get to the top, drop down and the fire that the blue, that excuse me, that's a red head is shooting at you should either be high enough for you that you don't have to dodge or if it's low enough, you can dodge by dashing. For this one, again, just charge up your shot, shoot him shoot them shoot and you will be fine I never bothers with the weakness of this head um, I never cares about it because the X buster is so powerful anyway so it doesn't really matter the blue head is the easiest one to dodge so yeah and again he does it again which I really hate I'm pretty sure there's a more reliable way to dodge it but X4 is a great game. It has a special place in my heart, but it's not a game that I came back always. You know what I'm saying? I prefer X5, which I would do an LP of because I love that game. So yeah, this one is gonna be die for the Sigma body will die first before the head, which is not very surprising because. The uh, body one usually a lot more easier to destroy than the head. The head, I don't like it because of that gravity gravity pulling attack. I don't know what it is, but he tried to suck you in, and I hate that move a lot. So I decided to charge it up. I don't really care about it anymore. So yeah, I charge it up and attack Sigma with it. So yeah, that's the final boss. When I was a kid, I thought this one is like one of the hard, hardest boss I ever fight. Because I couldn't fight him and destroy him in like for probably a few weeks. So yeah. And I think Sigma face is ugly on that body by the way. <laughs> but uh, yeah. We finished with the final boss. And now we try to stop the weapon which I think is kind of too late. General, what are you doing here? But then you will. General! I'll see you in the next part. I love this game. You're safe, X. I was really worried about you. Sorry about that. Don't worry. It's all over. Go home and rest. You've earned it. But Zero... What... What if I become one of the Mavericks? Don't ask such silly question. I'm breaking contact now. Wait, Zero! I'm... I'm serious! Zero, if... If I become a Maverick, you have to take care of me. Don't be ridiculous. Now hurry on back. Promise me. Zero.